you can pretty much tell everything by right here. Just hooking it up, start your vehicle, hook this up, and see what happens. Hey, don't be afraid. Do not be afraid. Most cars, unless you're driving a really old vehicle, take a R134A type of um, car air conditioner, okay? So don't be afraid to pop that hood. So don't be afraid to pop that hood and, and do what you gotta do. No, I gotta be honest with you, man. It feels good to have AC. I remember all ACs, no matter, no matter what kind of car you have, pretty much all of them, unless you're driving a really old model, take a R134. All right, so do not be afraid to pop the hood and do what you gotta do. Basically, you can tell this vehicle is full. It's got plenty of AC now. Um, okay, see where the arrow is. If it's up, that means your compressor is working. If it's down, that means you got to fill it up. If you fill it up and it keeps going down, that means it's busted. If it's in the red, you might have to do a tire thing, like a bicycle tire disinflate it take a nail or something put some gloves on that AC feels good it's blowing but the G says it's blowing anyway so if you're if you're trying to fill if you, your vehicle is on right and you've assembled it you've connected the hose and it's the, the arrow is here you, you may be in trouble your compressor may be shot if you fill it up, it stays up right here, and then it slowly goes down. That means you have a leak, and that sucks. Air, but pretty much this is all you need to test your vehicle. Be careful, though. It's not complicated. It's not rocket science. This hose right here is so simple. You can only connect this hose to uh, the fill, not the empty part, the fill. You only fill. So anyway, blowing real nice. I can feel it. Let's try the max. Oh yeah. That feels good as smack, dog. Anyway, 